Three hits. You see a couple of people approaching. God damn it. <laughs> Casual dress, jeans, t-shirts, <laughs> Latino couple, probably late 20s. They are carrying a fruit basket. Oh, boy. Nope. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> knock, knock, knock. Hello. I come over the, like, intercom. Mm -hmm. Hello. Can we help you? Yes, hi. Uh, I'm James. This is Lori Santos. We just uh, wanted to welcome you to the neighborhood. We know you're you're new to the area for a little while. You know, that's what we hear. What were their names again? Sorry. James and Lori. James and Lori. L O R I. Um. Thank you. Um, can't really open the door right now. I apologize. I'm masturbating uh, right now. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it. <laughs> <laughs> if just one, I appreciate the basket, but um, mm -hmm. we'll have to get, pick it up in, in a little bit. I've got a. We're working at the moment. Oh, oh, the oh, well, oh! Don't let us disturb. No, we wouldn't. Let's we'll leave it out here. <laughs> you, you know, I've got video on this, right? <laughs> it's <the same> yeah. <laughs> Let's we'll put this right down here. Okay. It's nice, nice to. I'm James. This is Lori. Nice to meet you. Someone nice. in this neighborhood's a damn assassin. I'm telling you. Right? <laughs> Uh, it, it will be nice to meet you uh, mm -hmm. later. Just please, we'll, in the middle of something, thank you. Oh. Absolutely, yes. No, well, we're around. You know, we'll see you. Yeah. Which uh, unit are you in? Four. <laughs> 304. You're in, are you in 304? No, we're in 304. We're in 304. We're in 304. No. 303. And the other one was 308. Okay. They were in unit eight, eight? I believe. Okay. Well, what they mean is unit 308 on this yeah. level. Huh. Uh -huh. Huh. Okay, okay. Because uh, all the units so on this level are three. They're unit 303? Yep. So they're your neighbors on the left. All right. And I turned it off and let it stay on the porch again. I'm good. Later, you'll see the Latino woman and the and the black woman you saw earlier sitting on a little bench by the elevators, looking at your unit, being like, "Well, they took the unicorns." I mean, it's oh my <laughs> god! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Look at the social anxiety on her. It's awesome. <laughs> You're fast enough. Just open the door, take the fruit, and close the door before anyone sees you. <laughs> It'll look like it vanished. <laughs> I'm telling you, that's an exploding fruit basket. Uh, obviously. I, mean, I told you, someone's an assassin. There's and you are paranoid as hell. Until I'm right. <laughs> <laughs> when you get taken up by an apple, then you know. <laughs> I'll miss you, and on your tombstone, my right wasn't paranoid enough. <laughs> <laughs> Done in by Apple. <laughs> Done in by Apple. <laughs> the fruit, not the computer. <laughs> <laughs> Steve Jobs had it for you pretty bad. <laughs> Kid for me from the grave. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we leave. I leave the fruit basket. Give me an there. audio perception test. Audio. <coughs> you hear a fuse. <laughs> <laughs> Coming from the pineapple. The banana's dynamite. <laughs> and then the Mission Impossible theme starts to play. <laughs> oh my. Oh my! <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six, You've been rendered seven dead. Seven hits. Damn. Oh yeah, no problem. You probably hit your limit there, but it doesn't matter. Uh, when it gets kind of quiet in the middle of the day, because people tend to be at work or working or whatever, mm -hmm. you hear, you know, bum, 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 and they got the window and the bandits out there eating your apple. <laughs> Not dead. <laughs> Not going for the fruit basket. Can we <laughs> accidentally <laughs> shoot this thing? <laughs> it, it's not accidental if we do it on purpose. <laughs> it's eating our fruit. We're not bringing it in. <laughs> Could be explosive. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, the well, you can't get mad at eating best fruit. It's still mine. <laughs> the bandit no, explodes. No, it's not. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's <a> <laughs> it doesn't explode. The band doesn't explode. I'm kidding. All right. So, moving on. The uh, Do you want to shoot the... No. <laughs> well, wait, do I want to? Yes. <laughs> Am I going to? Probably not. <laughs> We're making friends with this raccoon. I'm <laughs> saying that like, he likes team. us. Do you want me to bring him the fruit? <laughs> or the not now. Now well, Bandit's got it. Well, Bandit's not going to eat all of it, I don't think. I mean, he didn't <laughs> eat all the unicorns. It's not a unicorn. I mean, it's a 50-pound raccoon. I don't know what it's going to yeah, eat. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to try to get some of the fruit, go ahead. Is the raccoon still there? Yes. I will wait until it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> okay. When you go out there, there's one orange. The whole basket is gone. Oh, the, the whole basket, basket too? Yeah. 
You know what? For argument's sake, just leave the orange. <laughs> They'll assume it was the <laughs> raccoon and not that we're really weird and hate oranges. <laughs> It's three foot, 50 pounds of raccoon. It's just like <laughs> with the basket. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. What did the raccoon have against the unicorns then? We didn't give it this much time. <laughs> now he's getting comfortable. It likes fruit. It likes fruit. Fair enough. It makes healthy li- life choices. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's got antioxidants. It's, it's a fun. diabetic. <laughs> now, for bad, the neighbor's going to think, like, oh, they took the candy, but it didn't take the fucking fruit. <laughs> no, the fruit's gone. You see, now you're choosing sides. <laughs> <laughs> love this her this whole like Listen, social anxiety it's, it's the hispanic in me okay, okay. Mm. it's 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 just it's looking bad in front of people you know if they show up with like john and pork chops we're screwed <laughs> yeah absolutely. <laughs> throw the door open <laughs> welcome <laughs> Esta las frutas <laughs> and there's a block party <laughs> at our house <laughs> the block party at our house sun goes down uh, Conception shows up. <laughs> Is there still an orange on the, <laughs> on the steps? Different outfit. Hair in a braid. Carrying bags. Right. Comes in. Has your reagents, magical equipment. All right. All of that. This is probably going to start to look bad for us. Wrapped up in like little origami packages. Okay. Hey, every night we have a pretty attractive, well-dressed Latin woman show up with bags of stuff and then leave and not show up till the next night carrying more bags. And the only person who's allowed in the house. Yeah. This is not going to go well. Hey, they at least know that we're here for a business thing. So these are probably the protocols for it. And we hate oranges. We know we hate fruit. No, we love fruit, just not oranges. <laughs> and we're not returning their basket somehow. Return the basket either. <laughs> I, I answer the door. I let her in. Mm. I take yeah, she bag. comes in. You know, I Hola. Buenas noches. Help her with the bags. Mm. She got everything on the list. And then she turns to you and says, uh, can, <coughs> I, can I talk to you in, in private, please? Oh, this has never gone badly. <coughs> I wouldn't know. <laughs> sure. <laughs> in, in the bedroom? Or? Yeah, yeah, sure. So I walk to the bedroom. Whatever. All right. She closes the door behind you. <laughs> Sweetheart, I'm 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 getting worried about this. You know, I thought this was going to be resolved, but they're saying it's kind of indefinite. And uh, with the the government of the country uh, having put out the APB on you, I you know I don't know how long. This what worries me really is that the company will just decide to liquidate the three of you to be rid of the problem. Oh shit! Okay, now they haven't said that to me. And I would never do that. If they told me to do it, I would not do it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> not there. I know. Oh, my God. Mm. <sighs> Esta, estas mi hermana, you know that. And I, and I appreciate that very much. But I, I don't know how long, you know, because it's a big worry. If, if you are captured and they inter- you know things... Very valuable okay. to the company, and they would not want the DDI to know. And of course, the company knows right where you are. The company what? Knows right where you are. It's oh their safe God house. All right, so now it's a matter of figuring out how to keep ourselves on guard from the company that's supposed to be protecting us. I mean, I mean, you know, I'm just saying. Okay. I mean, I appreciate you telling me that's something you didn't have to do. And they haven't told they haven't said anything to me. I just think, it's you know, just 2 plus on the 2 equals, you know, <laughs> 2 plus 2 equals death. <laughs> <laughs> that's the name of this episode. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I got to figure out whether I need to keep this to myself or whether I should, should probably let them know, though. I mean, so at least we're all made aware. Well, I wanted to tell you. I mean, uh, you know, I think it's up to you. You know, I don't know the other two so well. 
No. And may, maybe, maybe it's nothing. Maybe it's my dreams. You know, I don't. But uh, no. But I mean, it's a serious trouble. And it's a very valid, uh, you know, concern. I, I think someone I in London is thinking the easiest thing to do is put you all in the garbage disposal. <sighs> okay. Now I will. I will break the news to them. Mm. And. Uh, and now, do you, do you do this while Conception's there? Or do you like, okay, let's go out and talk to them? Or? Um, well, well, Conception, um, would you rather I break the news to them with you here, or would you want to leave? I can do either. I mean, what do you think? Uh, I would say I would want you there. If nothing else, just if they have any questions, if you know anything mm -hmm. or whatever, you might be able to kind of help them along with that. Mm -hmm. Um, but if okay. you don't want to be there with the energy going on, I understand if you want to, if you want to. I will be there. I would, let, let's do it. Okay. I appreciate it. Thank you. Sure. Of course. Um, so I will go out and I would say, hey guys, we, we need to have a powwow. <laughs> of course we do. Uh, <laughs> um, so I, I, you I just, are I, so I, negative. I am. <laughs> I really am. <laughs> what, 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 what's, what, what's wrong? Uh, I break the news to them. <coughs> as gently as I can. <laughs> um, hey, the guys making your, uh, writing your paychecks, they want you dead, possibly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks for breaking it easy. <laughs> what's, uh, what's making you think that they want to liquidate us? <laughs> that is a horrible term. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I'm not sure, per se. Uh, I mean, it, was, it was a hunch that... I lost conception that... What's making you think that? Yeah, well, okay, no one has said anything to me, okay? But with so the DDI after you, that's the government of the Confederated American States. And, you know, that, that bulletin has gone out, you know, to other nations as well, extradition treaties and all that, okay? So uh, if, if you are captured, then you might be made to give up under interrogation, all sorts of information very valuable to the company. Now, no one has told me this, and I would not take this job. I would not take this job. <laughs> but I'm just thinking that, uh, you know, if you look at it, uh, someone's going to be thinking that that uh, the problem is not so much the DDI, the problem is you three. We've been nothing but loyal to the company, from, to the best of my knowledge. I don't, <laughs> I don't know. I know I have. I, I mean, I'm just saying it's a valid concern that she has, mm -hmm. and, and I wouldn't. But we're like, she's, she's done this for a while or because she's cautious, you know, so. Mm -hmm. I'm very cautious. I trust what she says. Um, that makes always always that look makes before you leap. That's my motto. I mean, and it's. It, it makes one of us so far. What, where's your head at, man? <laughs> He's going to say something about being paranoid about him being right now, <laughs> about being paranoid right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm no, not he even expected sure at it. this point. Uh, Didn't you? No. I've been loyal as hell to this company. I beat a miner with a plastic dick for this <laughs> company. <laughs> <laughs> you really gotta hear the story. Yeah. <laughs> Another time. <laughs> um, do you think they would do that? This quickly in the game? I have no reason to believe so. It's been two days. We've done some shit. I mean, no. for them to just decide to liquid is this quickly? Hmm. Now here's the concern. Um, we're we're technically supposed to be for, for here for at least two weeks. If um, Concepcion's hunch is correct in that it could be indefinite, or they could be, you know, we could be waiting a little longer. Uh, uh, I guess like the longer we stay here, I guess I would say like the more we would have to worry um, because now we'd have to figure out what to do with that extra time because she is right in the fact well, that if the only people that know who, who that we're here is in folio and all that jazz you know well if we decide to leave all of a sudden then we have no way of confirming one way or another but then we're out on, we're completely on our own which god forbid they don't decide to liquid as makes us look worse because that's a good point now we're off the grid and we just dipped i'm not saying to rush and jump to anything no i'll do like i mean it's it's a tough spot because like you know i with this tidbit of information i think <coughs> it's worth being on our guard 
but so is this just I don't want to Conception just doing the math. It's just a hunch. That's yeah. her mm-hmm. feeling on it. Mm-hmm. So no one has said anything to me. We can put it to a test. Okay. I said we put in a work order for weaponry. Something that can be delivered discreetly, but still put up a fight if the situation arises. Okay. If they outright deny that request, we know it may be in our best interest to move along. They're not going to supply us with the means to defend ourselves if they're planning on wiping us. Or they can give us that and come up with and come here with something stronger for them. No, because then they still they're still going to have they're still going to make it a, a giant event if they you know just burn the house down. Yeah, I mean if they come in with a helicopter gunship and just spray the zip code. <laughs> That's Fair hard enough. to keep that kind of, you know, on the down low. True, true, true. You know, All strip right. club in the backwoods is a little easier to cover up than, <laughs> you know, housing complex in downtown. So. <laughs> they might try to activate the ninja raccoon, though. You might, no. <laughs> Told you to just shot that little bastard. <laughs> the raccoon's name is Calico. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> and I'm questioning every decision I've made this far. <laughs> No, I, I like that idea. Let's see if we can put in okay. for weaponry. Conception says, "Look, I brought you something." She pulls out a cheap comm link. Okay, this is a burner, right? This is, you know, this is attached to a, an identity I don't use, but I want you to have it, and then you can contact me if you need to. Now you want to put in? You want to ask them for some guns? Yeah, rockets, <laughs> flamethrowers. Oh. <laughs> I'll leave it to your discretion. I need something mm. decently big. But not so big that you can't get it in without arousing suspicion. Mm-hmm. Okay. That will definitely okay. put up a fight if we were in such mm-hmm. uh, assault rifles. Yes. Maybe something along those lines. Okay. I'll do that. Cool. Hey, hey you know, I don't, I don't mean to. You know, I know you're under a lot of stress already, you know, so maybe this is just all me imagining things, you know? Mm-hmm. No, but it's a valid concern, honestly. Mm-hmm. We appreciate you at least bringing it to our attention. Okay. You know? Thank yeah, you. Thank you. Okay, enjoy the avocados. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm going to have an that. avocado. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, could be my last, apparently. <laughs> avocado she, as soon as she leaves, I'll mm-hmm. turn back to you guys. All right, wh- what do you believe about her? I'm not going to lie. I don't have any reason to not <coughs> trust her. She's that makes one of you. How she's never you? lied to you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that we know of. <laughs> 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 uh, how about you? <coughs> I don't know this chick. I, I don't know what to make of this. I can't say she's good at a job, but I can say that she does produce results, <laughs> question mark. <laughs> <laughs> but at the same time, she has no reason to warn us either. So I genuinely think that she considers Allegra a friend. Okay. And... I start putting up the ward. Yeah, I don't have a reason to distrust her. I have a gut feeling I don't like her. (laughs) (laughs) But dislike and distrust are two different things. So for now, I'll I'll take it at face value and just prep the best we can until, you know, something, at least something seems a little more definite. They're going to come after us. They've got all the, I mean, they know right where we are. They know the entire layout of this place. But my point is they're not going to do it two days afterwards. It's not like they just decided, okay, we're going to put you up in a safe house. Eh, we've had enough and just off us on day three. Or they could. What's saying that they can't do that? I'm hoping years of loyalty. <laughs> 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 I mean, n- not to toot our own horn, but we would be some big assets to lose. It would be some pretty hard marks to kill. <laughs> Let's just watch our bank accounts. If they go to zero, we run the hell away. <laughs> Can we even? We can't even access our bank accounts right now. Well, we have we the burner com now, but I'm not jumping on that right away, because yeah, we can't. I mean, if we go leg. searching our own stuff, they're gonna notice that it's been hit. Yeah. Well, they they Infolio can't can't monitor every transaction or every lookup at every bank in the world, you know. But uh, maybe. But probably <laughs> going to the bank down the street would not be the smartest choice. Yeah. <laughs> uh, regretfully, I say we're in a whole <coughs> pattern right now. It'd be smarter just to. Now we we need to start making at least uh, taking watch actual watches for the entire time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, I'm fine with that. And definitely not letting anybody in. Yeah, None keep of your these weapons people. close. Huh? Keep your weapons close. Yep. 
Uh, the ritual, the foot of the ward will take about 12 hours. It's 9.30 at night now, so that you'd be up all night. But if you want to... We can divide the first watch. That's not a problem. Yeah, yeah I'll have to, mm. and then I'll have to sleep after that, so I'm going to be out for a day, I guess. <laughs> mm. Sorry. That's fine. Yeah, worst case, we can do leave I need one to roll for that to for the swap every three uh, hours. Yeah. That's fine. First thing you have to do is set up a temporary magical lodge, but I'll hand wave that. Okay. Uh, I mean, I'm sleeping in the living room anyway. <laughs> yeah, I know I could do that. We never even set where. <laughs> now you can put up a 4 6 ward here. Uh, you spend the reagents, so okay. I think I then have your stuff. So, um, <coughs> Ash spends the night uh, in the living room uh, chanting to the Great Spirit, uh, pounding his chest, standing on his head, whatever is necessary uh, to raise the mystic energies. Moonwalk. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Moonwalk. Yeah, that, that seems. <laughs> We're going <coughs> to trade off every three hours so yeah. we at least get some sleep. Okay. Oh, they're having a rave. All, all, all the little lasers are pointed at the house. Uh, now you oh, wait a minute. <laughs> you have ritual spellcasting as a skill, right? Uh, yes, I do. <laughs> so you're going to roll that? War, it's just for spells, ward ritual is what it says there. I don't know if that would be my... Well, right, but you have the skill ritual spellcasting, right? Mm. I want to make sure... I hope you Skills. Uh, it, sorcery skill group is what it... Yeah, that includes virtual spellcasting. Okay. So your sorcery skill group. Uh, three successes. Uh, so uh, roll me charisma plus willpower to resist drain, and the drain on this is a little stiff. 